We've got a bunch that's gathering just to the southeast of us, so uh, some of the heaviest rainfall is yet to come today. And it's going to be kind of on and off. There's going to be quite a bit this morning, maybe a little break around midday with less rainfall and then picking up again during the afternoon. Here's a quick look at the rain that's currently moving through the area. Live Viper 5 Max showing you the showers moving into Lake Worth and out west of West Palm. Let's go down to Boca first. There's some pretty heavy rainfall right around Olympic Heights High School right now in the yellow there. Uh, this is all tracking inland. There's some rain moving into Del Rey right now. That'll be in Boynton Beach at about 530, about 10 minutes from now. Rain moving into Lion Country Safari and the acreage is a few showers way offshore of the Treasure Coast that could be in Stewart at around 617 this morning. And here's some of the really heavy stuff that's still gathering over the Bahamas here. If we track that, the bleeding edge of that could be uh, in the West Palm Beach area around 745. Low pressure down to the south yesterday. Uh, you may have heard the Hurricane Center gave this low a 20% chance for development, but not when it's near us. It gave it a 20% chance for development once it's up here near the Carolinas and then eventually it just moves out to sea. For us, it's just a rainmaker. We'll see if this 20% holds this morning. Computer models are sort of pulling back from that forecast. So we'll see what the Hurricane Center says later this morning. Uh, Boynton Beach uh, looks like we're going to see some rainfall, more rainfall from Boynton Beach south as we move through the next few hours here and some of that rainfall down to our southeast starts to move in. You'll see Vipercast gets a little bit of a break midday, but then does start to pick up again as we get into mid to late afternoon and into the evening hours. We're going to keep our eyes on this forecast. Of course, a lot of folks with evening plans, including Sunfest, which opens later this afternoon into this evening. Um, so we could be seeing some rainfall still around during the evening hours. There are some signs it might taper off a bit, but I would prepare for seeing at least scattered rainfall around during the late afternoon and evening hours. High temperatures today, low to mid 80s, showers and thunderstorms, more showers than thunderstorms, and some heavy rainfall possible uh, tomorrow and Saturday. Both days, looks like we'll see some sunshine during the morning and early afternoon, and then the chance for rain will pick up mid to late afternoon into the early evening and then taper off. Temperatures getting up into the upper 80s over the weekend. Sunday afternoon could be rainy on and off, not all all afternoon, but on and off and then pretty warm and humid as we get to the beginning of next week.